Whoa. Hey, YouTube. Whoa. Hey, YouTube. You haven't seen us in a long time on this channel. We're They're back. We're staying at We're back. Uh, Steve Price's place, and he's with us. That's Steve Price. L.A. <laughs> in L.A. If, I'm uh, he's, on, he's on YouTube as well as Steve Price, the real Slim Shady. I'm smoking this Black Morta reverse calabash that my friend Rick Black gave me, and it is a good smoker. He's the king of Morta. It's a beauty. You want a Morta? You should get a hold of uh, Rick Black. Nobody does a Morta like he does. That's the truth. And I'm smoking my new Dagner Pipe Poker with the copper band. I would definitely recommend uh, a visit to DagnerPipes.com. And... You're not getting one of those. They're sold out. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you can't get this one, but you can get something good. They got a lot of nice new pipes. In fact, can I just mention your uh, newest uh, yeah, edition, which is the they have a collaboration with Tom Eltang, the great Danish pipe master. It's called the El Dagner, and I believe it's available now, so you should check it out. It's a beautiful pipe. Uh, I would It's really available take... at danishpipeshop.com, but not on our site till probably after Thanksgiving when we get home. Okay. Because uh, my mom's working, and we didn't want to bombard her with 60 orders a day. Yeah. Keep your eye out for the El Dagner. It's a, it's yeah. a beauty. I have one, and I'm ha very happy with it. Great we'll, pipe. We'll have it available before December with uh, another little special something coming. And I hate to uh, shock all of you, but... No. <laughs> Drew Estate, Hurling Cherry. I got that from my Paul, my friend Paul. Paul's Pipes? Paul's Pipes gave me that. And it smokes pretty good. Uh, I don't think it's as good as the Cult, but it's pretty good. I'm smoking this. I got this in Las Vegas. Uh, this is from the Seattle Pipe Club. It's called... Pike Place. I just stuck it in an empty bat in the hat tin because I had a couple of bags of this. But this comes out, I believe, at the end of this month, November. Good stuff. Uh, it's a it's a Balkan with a burly flavor. About halfway through the bowl, you get a uh, nice, mellow, sweet, nutty taste, uh, like no other Balkan that I've ever tasted. And uh, they gave me a sample the first day of this, and I smoked the whole. You know, they gave me about an ounce of it. I smoked it all. I went back the next day, and I was like, man, I need a little bit more of that. And he gave me about three ounces, so I filled this sucker up. Good shit. I'm smoking a very unusual blend that <laughs> most people haven't tried. Germain's Plum Cake. Oh, Germain's. Not the McBaron Plum Cake. This is the Germain's Plum cake made on the British Isle of Jersey. It's a very, you know, very unusual blend. You, you know, you can find it. It's good. I'm enjoying it. Yeah. Well, S Steve is also on YouTube. Um, Steve Price. <laughs> Just look it up. We already covered that, but yeah. Steve's on YouTube. Yeah, Steve don't, Price. don't forget. Yeah, you're, you're <laughs> not going to forget now. <laughs> but uh, Steve invited us uh, to come stay with him and his wife, Lori. After our uh, shitty 48 hours in Vegas, which we won't even get into, we'll keep this positive. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, but, uh, you know, some motherfucker got it, you know. Um, other than that... We're having uh, a great time here in... We are. In the Simi Hills and the Santa Monica Mountains of Southern California. We got to catch up on rest today uh, and just relax. I actually got to... Steve took me to uh, Lenark Skate Park this morning to meet one of my childhood friends that we skated all the time together and he moved out here and we met up, had a nice session this morning and Steve hung out and brought us back and we haven't left yet. We've just been chilling and it's, it's, eating, yeah, sleeping. Eating. Steve made dinner, uh, super good dinner. Yeah, Steve's a real good cook. <clears throat> anyway, we've been having fun with the Dagners. They're good house guests. We're enjoying their company. <laughs> And we're having a good time. If any of you guys are uh, in uh, Los Angeles area on Sunday, we're going to be at the Los Angeles Pipe Club special meetup with the Dagners on Sunday at 3 o'clock at the, I think it's called Cigar Warehouse. Yeah. Cigar Warehouse. Ventura Boulevard, Sherman Oaks. If you're around, come out. You can uh, meet the Dagners, smoke a little, maybe buy a pipe, and we'll have a good time over there. Or you may get a free pipe. 
There's always a chance. Yeah, we always give free shit away, so it's worth coming. Yeah, come just out, to get come out on free. Sunday at three o'clock. But we're just gonna be there, hanging out, chilling, and smoking. We we weren't able to make our uh, our first schedule on November first like we had planned due to this fucking trailer. The trailer got another beating yesterday that I fixed this morning, and uh, we're we're making it up to LA. If I say I'm gonna do something, then I'm gonna do it. You know, we could have just went home from Vegas, which we probably, we I know we wanted to, but no, uh, I didn't. Well, <laughs> we just, uh, you know, we're we're true to our word, so uh, we're coming to hang out with you guys, and uh, and have fun on Sunday. You know, just a nice, chill and relaxed day, chilling and hanging out. It'll be fun. It'll be great. Know. It'll be great. Pretty much like last time. Pretty much like every day, chilling and hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> you want to tell them what we're going to do tomorrow? Ah, uh, tomorrow. Well, yeah. Tomorrow we're going to go adventuring. Adventuring. Yes. Adventuring. And we're going to just, you know, hit the road in the morning, go drive through the hills and the mountains and the beaches and see the, the natural sights of our area. We're just going to have fun. We're going to eat maybe some seafood by the beach. Climb, climb some mountains. New stuff. Surf uh, some waves. Going to Malibu, man. Uh, Cowabunga, dude. Can <laughs> Malibu Canyon, Topanga Canyon, uh, you know, and all the surrounding areas. We're going to have fun. I'm going to just see the sights of... Lori said we might hit Venice afterwards while we're there. That's always a possibility. I better bring my board just yep. in case. Yeah. So anyway, we're ready to have a good time. Yeah, we like yeah. seeing new things on these trips that we haven't done. I mean, we already went to Venice last year and the year before, but uh, man, I'll tell you what, the, the wilderness and uh, the non-city life is what I crave. Uh, like when we were at Paul's in Santa Cruz and Jason's in uh, Forest Hill, like I like that kind of scene and vibe, mellow, low-key, no hecticness. Uh, you know, my whole life's been hectic, so... It feels good to get a break every once in a while. Well, it really, <clears throat> really wasn't he hectic in uh, Tracy either. I no, mean, Tracy was you, chill you at Sarge's. Sarge's. Yeah, that was um, mellow. Sarge is just, he's quite a craftsman. Yeah, he taught me how to throw knives. That was yeah, cool. we were doing that yeah. this I, time. I did see the knife throwing video. <laughs> I, to be honest with you, when I first started, I'd never done it before, and I sucked big time, but... About four hours later, I was a skilled professional knife thrower. I could, <laughs> I mean, I could just look, and I, I didn't concentrate on anything else. I just looked where I wanted that thing to go, <laughs> precision every time. And Elaine became quite a, a whip star. Uh, yeah, she became a, uh, a California cracker. <laughs> yeah, she was <laughs> cracking that thing. The girls are in the house. They're uh, chit chatting about girl stuff and. Uh, I don't know. I gotta tell him about that painting on your, on your wall, though. Steve's got uh, like the best painting ever. You walk in his house, and it's probably forty-eight by thirty-three, yeah, it's thirty-four. It's actually I think sixty by sixty. Oh my god, <laughs> it's big. And when you first, all you do is you, it's a, a naked woman, almost you know, holding a baby man child. But really, all you see is her grown bush between her gap and her legs with a nice shaped ass. Well, hey, am I lying? Yeah, you're hey. telling the truth. Yeah. You're telling the truth. That's what it is. Yeah, by the uh, famous LA artist Alfredo de Batuc. Yeah. yeah, it's a good painting. Yeah. Man, I, I might try to put a picture and post on Instagram, but some asshole will fucking flag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You may uh, end off. up in you know, you'll end yeah, up in prison or something for that. Yeah. You, you know, uh, Steve's got some very unusual plants around. I've I spent all morning going around and taking pictures of the plants. Are they all succulents? Yeah. Jay liked, uh, likes our collection of succulent plants, so before you guys leave, I'm going to make a bag. I'm going to make cuttings of all of them. You can take them home and well, basically home, just stick them in pots, and they'll grow. We forget the water plants, and then they die. That's okay. No, no, you don't have to. These plants don't need much water. Yeah, if it rains in Florida, they'll be happy. That's why I want to take them home. Because <laughs> we're... We, we're plant killers. I wish it wasn't dark right now because I could turn the camera and show you up this hill. But, like, you walk out in the morning, and if you guys saw my Instagram picture this morning where this view isn't that bad, I walk up, I go up, I don't know, what, maybe 100 feet, and I can just see all the tops of the Canyon Mountains from up here. And Steve's got a bench and a little table. You can sit there. You don't hear anything. And just be in peace and one with yourself. Did it on sunrise and sunset. 
Super good up it's there. Nice, yeah. Good times. Yeah. Look at this beautiful fireplace behind us. Yahoo! <laughs> yeah, it, it's probably, I don't know, what, 65 out? Temperature wise? Yeah, getting out of 60 now. But it's supposed yeah. to be, it'll be a little, it'll be cool tonight. But it right? feels good. I mean, I'm in a t shirt. You're in a long sleeve shirt. But other than that, uh, I haven't decided, or we haven't decided if we're going to leave Monday or try to maybe stick it around one more day uh, Tuesday. I'm going to call my friend Eric. I yeah. don't, we don't have phone connection right now. We don't have any cell phone service here. So if people have been trying to get a hold of me, uh, it's it's Wi-Fi only. Uh, Voxer, you know, look my name up over there if you don't have it. Uh, the other thing is, uh, there's we know a lot of people here in LA. And man, we really like to get to see everybody. And uh, for the guys that can't make that nice. Sunday meetup, it'd be nice to at least maybe do a Monday night dinner or something, or uh, I don't know, somewhere in town. But I hate coming all this all this way here and not being able to at least give uh, you know one person I know a hug, saying what's up. Well. You know? It's yeah, either yeah. If, if we do that, then we're sacrificing, you know, blood family Thanksgiving back at home. Uh, I, I know you don't give a shit. You know, I, I don't really give a shit either. But, <laughs> uh, you know, Elaine likes to be with her parents. Um, you know, we could always give her the option to fly home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know. I, I, I thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe camp out another week. But the other thing is my mom is going on vacation uh, Sunday. So there'll be nobody to ship orders unless somebody's home. Uh, Sunday the 20... What's... Fuck, I don't even know what the date is. Not this, not this Sunday, but next Sunday. So somebody needs to be home to ship orders. So we'll figure it out. Uh, you know, if I'm stuck in L.A. for another week, oops, you know. Shit yeah. happens. Yeah. If Elaine flies back, she can do the orders. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah that's an option, I I'm guess. I'm always thinking. But we'll leave that up to her. I know she doesn't want to fly back. She wants to she wants to road trip yeah. and spend the time with us. I let her She wants to get to the finish line. Yeah. I let her drive last night and <laughs> when we came here we came through the winding S curves up and down the mountains and she was driving, and I have to say, she did a fantastic job. She did, but goddamn, I was scared. Yeah, my palms were sweating. I was holding on to the old <laughs> shit bar, and, and they, it was a like kind of like a flashback from Paul's. While he was driving, I was riding in the back, looking out the window at the edge of the road, a hundred feet down. While Elaine was doing that, I'm riding in the back, and I'm looking down, I'm like. Kyuh. I'm like, hug the inside line. We yeah. won't go off. Jason's going, you should see this view. And she goes, no, I got to watch the road. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it was, what was that first canyon that we came through? That little, uh, well. In the, well there it, must have been a hundred curves on that road. Yeah, when you got off the, when you got off the freeway. Hour ones. Yeah, Chatsworth Lake. The Chatsworth Lake area, if any of you guys know where that is. But there's just a small country road. For, you know, several miles of, of little country, one lane country road, two oh, lane yeah, country yeah. road, and there was nothing out there but yeah. curbs. Yeah, at night it's a little tricky, especially with your big vehicle. Yeah, <laughs> but you made it safe. Yeah, we did. Yeah, Thank goodness. The trailer has got a, a beating this this trip, so uh, yeah, we'll we'll fix it later. <laughs> well, so other all that, right. Other than that, we're uh, we're just gonna chill and hang out the rest of the night. Try to. Try to get in the bed a little bit early so we can get up early and go on an adventure tomorrow. Um, I've got a couple friends in Florida that are that are uh, coming to LA tomorrow that want to meet up. We've got a couple friends from Florida that live here. Yep. So uh, it's going to be a busy couple of days. So uh, chime in, and I really hope everybody can come to the uh, Los Angeles Pipe Club meetup. If you don't know where it is, go to their instagram or their blog on their website los angeles pipe club all the info's on there there's a post on my instagram i'm sure there's a facebook or something but i don't have it yeah. uh you know i guess if i got time i can put the address in the video we'll see uh wi-fi is uh in and out here so well, hopefully we'll see everybody on sunday sounds great yeah all right see all you right, youtube folks. look at bye bye sarge <laughs> <laughs> Adios, amigos. All right. Wild hogs. Peace. <laughs>